The next problem we have that to prove that the following is an irrational, we have the number root 3 plus root 5. So for this problem, root 3 and root 5 are irrational as separate numbers. So only after you, can, you know that root 3 and root 5 are irrational as separate numbers can you, you can solve this problem. So for, uh, the same way as we have done the first problem, let us try to assume that this expression is a rational number. Let root 3 plus root 5 is equal to a by b. assume it as a rational number where a and b are co-primes and b is not equal to 0. Now if I send root 5 on the other side we will have root 3 equal to a by b minus root 5. On squaring, we will have uh, 3 equal to, this would be a square by b square plus 5 minus 2 root 5 into a by b. Now, if I get uh, this a by b term on the left hand side and 3 onto the right hand side, I would be having 2 root 5 a by b equal to a square by b square plus 5 minus 3. 2 root 5 a by b equal to a square by b square plus 2. Now taking LCM on the right hand side, I would be having 2 root 5 a by b a square plus to b square by b square. Now if I send a and b onto the right hand side and also 2 onto the right hand side, I would have root 5 uh, a square plus 2 b square by 2 a b after solving it all. Now a and b are integers as we have previously assumed. Now a and b are integers as we have previously assumed. Therefore that would make a square plus 2b square by 2ab a rational number. And this assumption or would also mean that root 5 is also a rational number since it is equal to a square plus 2b square by 2ab. But before uh, doing this problem as I have already told you that we have already assumed, we, have, we already know that root 5 is an irrational number. But irrational number. So therefore, root 3 plus root 5 is also irrational.